So setting your weekly goals. Each week you will have a section for planning the upcoming week and reviewing the previous week. So when you're planning the upcoming week, you will have three goals to outline for the week ahead. Just like you have three milestones, um, and when we get into the daily section, you'll have three uh, molehill goals to accomplish. So with your weekly plan, you wanna outline three weekly goals that are directly aligned with your milestones. So I like to pick a weekly goal, one weekly goal for each of my milestones. That, that won't always be the case, right? So at some point, you're gonna move ahead, maybe you accomplish one of your milestones, something like that. You won't always be able to have a one for one, but whenever possible, I like to have one weekly goal that is directly aligned with one milestone. All right. Um, also on this page, we talk about doing some things to just help stay on track, like setting reminders on your phone for uh, a couple days a week, just to remind you of your weekly goals. Um, in the book, I recommend Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. You, you can just go into your reminders app on your phone. Um, type up what those weekly goals are, set it to remind you at a convenient or inconvenient time, um, just to kind of uh, bring your mind back on track. Um, so plan your weekly goal ahead. Then we move on to the review section. In the review section, you'll do a couple things. One of the things that you'll do there is you'll look back at your previous week. You'll look at the rating on each day. Um, if you flip ahead and look at one of the daily sections, you'll see at the bottom on the right, you have a review section um, that will give you a, a, a point total for that day. It's a very simple, straightforward process, nothing elaborate, you don't need a calculator, um, but it'll give you a point total for that day. What you wanna do is, is you wanna answer the question that says, how could you replicate the day that had the best uh, point, right? So. Go to that day, look at the all the context around that day and think about what made you rate it so high and how could you replicate that day? Because obviously moving forward, we wanna have as many great days as humanly possible. And then the next question is, the days that were the lowest, why were they the lowest? And how can you avoid them? Because we wanna have as few bad days as possible. I mean, I know it seems logical, but a lot of people, uh, don't think about it like this. You need to think about how you can uh, replicate your good days and avoid your bad days. So that's kind of what we do in the weekly section is we, we set three goals for the upcoming week. We look back and see uh, to see what went good in the previous week and what went bad in the previous week. And we note all of this. So next we're gonna move on to the daily section.